All right, so we're here at Qualcomm, and what are we going to look at today? Hi, uh, yeah, me and Hi from Qualcomm Labs on the Gimbal team, and Gimbal, it's an SDK that's on iOS and Android that brings context awareness to applications. So what we're looking at here is uh, the new Star Trek Into Darkness application that's the official app for the, for the movie. And what they've done is they've created new experiences for Star Trek fans to go unlock real-world content using all the sensors on their phones, and that's what Gimbal provides, is an understanding of what the sensors can interpret and really mean. So you can see here the app, it'll tell you news about the movie, but then it also starts to let you understand the environment around the movie. Uh, I'm going to show uh, the ability to understand and recognize real world imagery. Uh, so we're going to have to kind of shoot over someone's shoulder here, but it won't matter too much because we can even capture with a small piece. Um, so the movie poster? Yeah, so we captured the image of the Star Trek poster, so they'll send you out into a movie theater to capture that. Uh, we'll go back to missions. They have geo-based missions, so they're going to send you on. You're going to unlock promotional content or trips to the premiere based on go to a movie theater, any movie theater, and do the same. Scan a poster. Uh, and then, uh, so we've kind of hit location as a context that they've incorporated, uh, use of the camera as a context they've incorporated, but they've also done sound recognition. Um, so we don't, we're not close enough to the trailer here. But if you're in the movie theater or you're at home, you can listen to the, the commercial and it will understand the, that you've heard that particular piece of content and you'll unlock more. Right. So it's gamified, it's using the sensors, and Paramount then can probably gather more detailed information about the users, I would imagine. Yeah, the, the benefit is twofold. Both consumers get a new contextual experience that allows content to really adapt to what mobile's good at, which is what's going on in the world around you. Right. But then on the flip side, um, you get to understand if you're paramount how consumers are engaging with your content and measure on an aggregate basis um, what the uh, whether or not it ultimately leads to, did someone really go see the movie? Right. And now this is not cloud-based then, this is happening on device. Yep, uh, so we do a couple quick. We do a couple things. Um, so from a privacy perspective, we keep as much data down on the on the on the phone as possible. Okay. Um, also from uh, making it work better and costing perspective, recognition of that poster was on the client, a recognition of a sound clip is gonna be on the client, recognition that I'm out of place, the movie theater is gonna be on the client. Um, and then only very selectively does it interact with the, the cloud to um, provide updates dynamically when things change.